did a little upgrade of the Chinese diesel heater. Things been incredible. I can't say enough good things about it. The only problem we were having was I wanted to get a little more fuel runtime out of it. A bunch of different ways to do that. I kind of picked the way that I thought was best. I ended up getting a five gallon jerry can and the Overlander, I believe it's called the Overlander kit holder for this. It is the most expensive one out there, but it works incredible. Literally, you secure it to the wall, it's got one latch on it. Take it off, pull this down. Now that can completely comes out of there. The difference on this one is, I ended up putting a quick release right here on this, so I can snap this quick release off, pull this can right out. Also what I did was, we put a three-way switch on this, so now I can run off the diesel heater on the left, the little tank, or I can run off that big can on the right. The only problem was I had to make a bigger shelf for this, obviously because I needed the room for the can. I had to slide the heater down. I had to get a new exhaust tube, which was not a big deal. They're cheap. But it works incredible. Fill that can up. It, it lasts. I, you, there's plenty of videos to show how long it lasts, but I can't say enough good things about it. It's incredible. I just did the fuel line kit. Those are all over Amazon as well. Just did the fuel line kit in the back of it right here. It, the things worked incredible. I've honestly thought about putting another one in here for next year just to really crank it up for winter at night after changing or hanging out for a few hours working on the sleds. But one of those things I've been meaning to do and uh, finally got around to it. I like it because if I want to take that can out, I can still run a day's worth of heat off of that little gas tank that's on the heater. Let me know what you guys think. Thanks.